New information about the victim and the two suspects charged in connection with that badly burned body found in a mobile neighborhood. Our Morella Porter live from Metro Jail right now with the very latest. Morella. Byron, we now know the victim and suspects were neighbors. Today, we tried talking to other people in the neighborhood to see what they might have seen, heard, or know. Most people either didn't come to the door or weren't willing. But this morning, one of the suspects was talking. What do you have to say, Amber? Final words from Amber Kuta before heading off to jail. Here you can see the other suspect, Timothy Buford, mouthing I love you to the woman accused of killing 57-year-old Tracy Griffin. Kuta and Buford are both charged with murder and abuse of a corpse in connection to the discovery of a burned body found at a home on Bonneville Drive yesterday. Police believe sometime Tuesday night, Kuta and Griffin got into a fight at Griffin's home, a fight that ultimately led to her death. Investigators say Kuta then called Buford to help her get rid of the body. Two days later, and that's when she, the victim was discovered in the backyard deceased. Officers found Griffin's body severely burned yesterday morning. Dubo says though a motive is not known, the victim and two suspects were neighbors. These suspects would come to the victim's house because I believe they lived across the street or in the area. Buford was arrested Wednesday morning on an unrelated charge. Live at Metro Jail, Morella Porter, Fox 10 News.